On The Move crew attended the San Jose Abilities Expo and visited many of the informative and interesting exhibits about adaptive equipment and services. We talked with Pam Prentice and Dan Margulies while at the Bay Area Association of Disabled Sailors booth, and they agreed to come visit with On The Move in the studio for an interview. Now our host, Donna Yeager, will talk with Pam and Dan to hear about their latest experiences with the Bay Area Association of Disabled Sailors and the San Jose Abilities Expo. Now here's Donna. Hi, I'm Donna Yeager with On The Move, and I'd like to welcome our special guest, Pam Prentice. Welcome, Pam. Hi. <laughs> and Dan Margulies. Welcome, Dan. Hello, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Now, we recently uh, uh, saw you guys at the Abilities Expo yeah. in San Jose, California. That was so exciting. I had a wonderful time. Did you guys enjoy the show? Yes, we yeah. had a good turnout. Yeah, we yeah. found a lot of people <laughs> interested in sailing. Yeah, yeah. And they had no idea about BADS. And yeah. So I think it's going to be a really exciting year. Yeah, definitely. And actually, the expo itself was interesting because there were a lot of new booths there that I'd never seen before. Huh? Right, a lot yeah, of, yeah. yeah, a lot of new, both equipment and also organizations and groups. Right. Yeah, exactly. And the technology is constantly changing and there's all kinds of really neat things that are uh, available right now that uh, I didn't even see last year, so <laughs> <laughs> pretty exciting. <laughs> it's amazing what they come up with. Mm -hmm. And I think <laughs> as the demand decreases and right. people want to get out and about, um, yeah. Technology is catching up. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> it certainly is. And actually, the um, um, one of the booths that I thought was interesting also was, uh, the, you know, the little, uh, well, the one that Stephen Hawking use, uses. It's like a board oh, with right, a whole yeah. bunch of different words right. on it. And it's like the size of a phone. Uh, you know, an iPhone. It's amazing. <laughs> well, now that they have that software developed, they yeah. can, yeah, put it on a phone as well right. as an iPad or yeah, something yeah, like yeah. a tablet, right? It's ex oh, it's just wonderful. Yeah. But, I mean, there are a lot of things like that that, you know, just I couldn't even imagine that even, you know, 15 years ago. So it's If we would have had just half of what we have now. Yeah, right. I mean, cell phones and yeah. all the computers and the size mm -hmm. is so small and portable. Right. It's been great for people with disabilities. Exactly. It's so true. It's really and true. Facebook. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's true. Too. It allows us mm -hmm. to know. I mean, we posted that the yeah. expo was going on yeah. every day. We right. showed photos and a lot of people came <laughs> in just because they saw it on Facebook. Wow. And I saw it on the news, actually. Friday Excellent. evening they had it on the news. I guess it was Channel 4 or Channel 5. And uh, they had a really good coverage. Right. You know? And there was also, yeah. I saw an uh, ad for it in the Mercury News. So yeah, yeah. They got into most of the papers, too. Oh, know? good. Yeah. Good. That's great. Well, and did, Daniel, did you get a chance to walk around the... Uh, yes, yeah, yeah. Okay, I good. did make a point to yeah. <laughs> do a good walk around since I was there yeah. anyway, and <laughs> uh, and meet a lot of the people and yeah. you know find out what was going on. Good, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. and it's kind of fun too, Pam. How you're actually um, when you walk around, you you see people that you haven't seen in a while, right? Yes, <laughs> uh, that's right. Yeah. I mean, I ran into several people that I used to work <laughs> with, or people socially. It's like, oh yeah. my gosh, I haven't seen you. We, we're in the South Bay, and yeah. they live in the North Bay, uh, and we all were <laughs> together in San yeah. Jose. It was, it was a really nice weekend. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And the weather was good. The weather held up for yes, us. Yes, <laughs> it was great. Yeah. We worked out there, too. <laughs> we want the rain, but it yeah. really didn't start until evening. Right. Well, and also, um, our, our friend Lou is one of the organizers of the Abilities Expo, and he was amazing. <laughs> we got to do a little interview with him, and he's he's so he's such a character. He's really funny. But uh, anyway, he was saying that you know um, they made it free to everybody, because uh, you know in years past, I guess different uh, 
of Villages Expo, they charged for... I think they used to charge years ago, but oh, the, right, the, right. the business model now, which is the way to go, yeah. is that the expo's free. The, right. the parking is yeah. still, you got to pay for that, but that's, right. you know, part of San Jose. Yeah, exactly. And, right, uh, right. Yeah. You know, so, but that's good. I mean, that's the way to get the turnout. Right, right. Yeah. And the, the parking actually is really accessible. If yes. you park in the garage yeah. area. The location is very good. Mm, for you that. don't get drenched. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it is nice. I mean, there's other parking right across the street, too, so not bad. <laughs> not too bad. <laughs> but anyway, so that's good. Um, and I know that when uh, you were at the booth, uh, Pam, you said that you got a lot of people to sign up. For yes, that, we right? were collecting uh, emails <laughs> yeah. and yeah. asking them what were they interested in uh, because right. we are really looking for people that would like to sail or right. help right. sail yeah. and just trying to understand their needs and yeah. so moving on with BADS, yeah. Yeah. the Bay Area Association of Disabled Sailors, yeah. letting the <laughs> them know um, what's available yeah. and I think it was a, a really powerful a uh, weekend. Yeah, we got to s learn a lot and meet a lot of people, and <laughs> yeah. and now we'll take out people out on the bay, out All on right. the water <laughs> that didn't have the opportunity before. Exactly, and in fact, Daniel, um, when you guys invited us to go or on the move crew, I um, I was uh, very lucky to go on a beautiful day. It was perfect. <laughs> I I um, I'm just so so. Thankful that it wasn't too windy and <laughs> the the boat was uh, it was fun. We were definitely cruising, but it wasn't like uh, so we were you know, leaning that far over. <laughs> so I felt very safe in my gimbal seat. <laughs> well, we I, try to pick yeah. days, you know, when we think the the weather's going to be good. But yeah. of course, when you're trying to judge from right. down here in the South Bay what it's going to be like in San Francisco, right. it can be a little bit of a guesswork. Yeah. <laughs> That everybody with BADS is very skilled in safety. Yeah. I think safety is a huge issue, a priority. Right. And like Daniel's an excellent uh, sailor. Yeah. And he's always making sure people feel really comfortable <laughs> oh, and relaxed on the boat when he's on the boat. And yeah. all of our skippers are, yeah. are very, very yeah. nice. Well, that's wonderful. And actually, I'm going to go back to the, um, the Abilities Expo because it was spectacular. You had two of the boats right there in your booth. Yeah, yeah. that got attention. <laughs> wow. And the, they were, I mean, what are those called? The, the, well, those, the, uh, old, the, uh, old the company is called, uh, well, it was called Axis. It's now uh -huh. called Hansa. Oh, okay. And what they do is they make the small dinghy boats, oh, okay. which is half of our programs wow, yeah. is to sell those. And <laughs> so those are basically one and two people boats. And <laughs> Basically, it's a go kart on water, <laughs> so it's uh, yeah. they're very fast, yeah. you know, uh, easily to maneuver kind of little boats, and yeah. uh, so we use the two person one to train people right. how to sail, wow. and then when they get good enough, we'll let them go out on their own on the other yeah. ones that are single person and a little bit faster boats. Wow! And uh, wow. yeah, so that's our programs that we do on Saturdays. That's amazing. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, they were really tall in the. <laughs> and the expo and like, I wow. like that yeah. because I can tell people just look look to the ceiling mm. find the sailboat <laughs> on the yeah. horizon yeah. and go towards it well, they, they were small yeah. enough we could get them into the expo hall with no wow. problem yeah. wow yeah That's incredible. and we even uh, our Commodore Christina yeah. Rupke yeah. Uh, did a wonderful uh, demonstration with the servo uh, unit oh, yeah. so we took the boat over to her and so she wow. could explain more about the boat itself so <laughs> they were moving around the show we got a lot of attention oh, that's really <laughs> yeah it was not just a, a display but actually a moving display i'm sorry i missed that yeah, <laughs> yeah that we, uh, been interesting. we took one of the boats over to the arena area and wow. had a little demonstration yeah. about it cool. and talk about it yeah, yeah. it was kind of like a float wow. within the expo although yeah. we went on the edges <laughs> Right, because in the arena they had uh, uh, a bunch of uh, dancing display d demonstrations. And, yes, it was and a, a nice size yeah. uh, no. stage. Yeah, yeah. And sporting 
you know, oh, yeah, yeah, right. uh -huh. had yeah. a number of different sporting events. That's right. So, yeah. Wow. So it was very good for that. Yeah, yeah. definitely. <laughs> but I'm sorry I missed that part, though. That would have been fun to see. And uh, actually, uh, Christine was, uh, was there the day that we went sailing, too, so that was fun. Oh, she, she's amazing. <laughs> she's an amazing sailor and yeah. a teacher and a great leader. Yeah. Um, <laughs> And she attends many of the events nationally and internationally. Wow. Oh my goodness! <laughs> even with her full-time job as an attorney. Oh yeah, my gosh! And um, she was. Uh, I, I'm wondering also how many people uh, were actually able to sign up uh, when you were there, or when you, you know, different I people think... manned the booth different days. Yeah, oh. it's hard to say because it was over a three-day period, and well, yeah. so I don't know. <laughs> But I think the big thing was is that we, in addition to signing people up, we yeah. also were able to educate people oh, on sailing yeah, and yeah. letting them know that we really can accommodate people no matter what their ability is. Yeah. So, wow. Yeah. Well, like I sat in the, uh, what did I call it, the gimbal chair. Mm -hmm. Right. On the and boat. On the boat, right in the middle of the boat. <laughs> I had a lovely view. <laughs> you do. You probably had perfect. one of the best views. <laughs> it was perfect. <laughs> Center. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It was and wonderful. again, you felt safe. I oh, mean, yeah. people yeah. were really trying to help you oh, yeah. feel comfortable and relaxed, yeah. Yeah. In that, and that's the goal. Uh huh. Is, well, we had a full crew, too. Uh huh. And I know that, um, like our wonderful crew, our On the Move crew, everyone is volunteer, and I know that. You guys need a lot of volunteers, uh, able-bodied yes. as well as disabled people. Right, too. about half the membership yeah. is able-bodied, <laughs> yeah. and so they help out. Yeah, and, yeah. And uh, <laughs> then the other half that have a disability, it's yeah. every kind of disability you could imagine. <laughs> yeah. So we cover everything. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, yeah. yeah, and so that gimbal chair was on one of our larger keel boats. Oh, right, right. So yeah. we have an <laughs> Islander 36, and then yeah. the, that one was on our Catalina 30. Uh, yeah. And so, you know, we end up with a f crew of maybe seven or eight people right, in a right. boat like that. And also, you have a, a new program that you're working uh, with the veterans, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. We started a couple of years ago <laughs> yeah. to, uh, uh, as p working with the VA hospital in uh, yeah. San Francisco, is oh, cool. to take veterans out and <laughs> as an activity to help them uh, yeah. <laughs> readjust back to life. Right, so, right. Yeah. yeah. And I mean, that's hard. That's, uh, you know, you're, uh, I think that sailing would be a great way to, you know, kind of make somebody relax and, and feel one with the, you know, with the universe. Right, with, yeah. I mean, the water is so soothing and, yes. oh, just so beautiful, right? And, and really they enjoy yeah. the fellowship, too, right? because they yeah. bring their friends, other veterans, <laughs> yeah. on the boat. Uh, introduce them to <laughs> the other sailors, and right. and we teach them how to sail if they don't know how, oh, and that's a yeah. huge uh, accomplishment. <laughs> right. It builds a lot of confidence uh -huh. after yeah. what they've been through, yeah. and wow. it it's a wonderful group of people, oh, cool. and many of them are are really strong. Yeah, yeah. So you know, with the boats and helping other people with uh, disabilities, yeah. they're a huge asset. To right, the, right. The, organization but it's a recreational activity that you yeah. know they can do almost regardless of their mm -hmm. disability yeah. mm -hmm. and right. so that's one of the nice things about sailing yeah. is it accommodates <laughs> right. various types very yeah. well yeah. yeah well i was just trying to remember um when we went there was a gentleman who was uh i think he was a paraplegic and he was super strong he was sitting on the front right side of the boat and i don't know what you call him but the all the ropes, you know, that you have to... Right, the lines, yeah. Yeah, and there's like the ratcheting thing that he had to right. tighten, and it's like, wow, that's a lot of work. <laughs> it is, you get a great workout, yeah, that's yeah. for sure. You and learn he was balance. Doing he was doing all of it. Yeah, like, yeah, this, the, yeah our, our two big keel boats that yeah. we take people out on are, you know, they're, they're yeah. basically a standard <laughs> boat. Uh, right. We've made a few modifications to yeah. accommodate people, yeah. but uh, yeah, so... Uh, the people that go out, depending on their disability and yeah. and their desire and <laughs> right, what they right. want, some just go out as passengers for the uh, ride, which yeah. is great, and others get very involved in actually s selling the boat. Wow! And so, yeah, so he was probably on the winches, you know, taking in the sheets. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of work, but 
I mean, he was keeping up with the able body guy on the left side of the yeah. boat doing, <laughs> doing the same job. It's like, oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> but it was really cool to, to watch that because it's like, whoa. <laughs> really excellent. <laughs> it was a lot of fun. It, it really takes your mind. If you have yeah. a stressful day, yeah, right. a stressful <laughs> week, a job that, you know, is yeah. less <laughs> unusual, you get out on the water with everybody and pretty soon everything is just clean and right, right. calm and, yeah. and you get all kinds of motivation <laughs> to do, you know, get in there and to help yeah. the sailors, help the belt. Well, and I know um, also Christine <clears throat> is a uh, in a teensy bit similar situation to myself. And so she said that she's able to, to uh, steer the smaller uh, oh, yeah. boat. With the servo unit. Yeah. Yes. Wow. So we have a servo set up so uh -huh. that we have basically electric <laughs> motors that control uh -huh. the sails and the rudder. Oh, I and see. since she has uh -huh. no use of her arms or legs, right, right, right. Yeah. we yeah. have a joystick that's on a little chin cup. Oh. So by using her chin, she can maneuver the sails and the rudder really? and steal the boat. Oh and, uh, you know, she started doing this a number of years yeah. ago. And, yeah. you know, in the beginning was learning how, but yeah, yeah. by sticking with it consistently, she's now wow. a very competitive racer. Really? So, yeah. Yeah, she's turned into, you know, oh. a very, very good sailor. Yeah. How exciting. Oh, and that gosh. encourages other people. Yeah, right. Yeah. They see her by example, and mm. that really yeah. motivates them <laughs> yeah. to uh, learn more. Yeah, yeah, that's great. And, I mean, you have to learn the rules of, the, of you know, water etiquette, too. Who yeah. goes first? The bigger boats go before the... Itty bitty ones, <laughs> yeah, because they don't have as much control. Yeah, know, well, yeah. Part ones. of it is that we do teach everybody not only right. how to sail, but right. if you will, the the, the rules of the of the sea, <laughs> yeah. as opposed to the, the rules, rules of the, of the road. road. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, for the people that are really interested, then yeah. well, actually, if they want to become a skipper of a right. boat, right. there's yeah. an eight week training course uh, in the classroom, and well. then there's additional eight weeks of training on uh, the boat itself. Oh, cool. And so. Yeah. And then some uh, other uh, things they have to qualify for. But, yeah, uh, wow. you know, it's a way to learn to become a skipper if you want to really take charge of the whole boat. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And it actually is a really good thing to know. Yeah. It builds confidence on the water. Uh -huh. And then, uh, you know, it's just a nice thing to add <laughs> yeah. to what you know. Right, you right. Know? Yeah, that's Everybody great. wants, that's probably one of the first things. So do you go sailing? Oh, yeah. Oh, and that. <laughs> starts the whole conversation. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you live in the Bay Area, yeah. <laughs> right, right, you have right. to at least try it once. Exactly. <laughs> I know. Well, I think we need to get more of my disabled friends out there. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yes. Yeah. That's our goal. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. That's wonderful. It's a, it's a passion, I think, of everybody that yeah. is with the group <laughs> and definitely people that have been long-term members. Yep. Uh, they really want to help other people right. enjoy <laughs> yeah. this fabulous bay. Oh, I mean, we're oh, really it's fortunate. It is. It's wonderful. And I know that you uh, work on a newsletter, right, Pam? Uh, yeah. yeah, I write the BADS <laughs> blog, yeah, okay. and I take a lot of the photographs, yeah. and I really enjoy it because it, it helps me yeah. learn <laughs> about what other people are doing, and I email them. Yeah. and. And, and then also, you know, just a nice one-to-one <laughs> -one contact. Right, right. And then I've done a few videos for them <laughs> uh, that's on YouTube. Right. And yeah. so you just look up uh, B-A-A-D-S <laughs> and you search YouTube and yeah. you can see all kinds of videos that wow. other people, uh, <laughs> professional organizations, yeah. And yeah. they come out and they film us. and. Yeah, we get a lot of hits. A lot of people are very interested. Yeah, in, um, I think each one of the members, uh -huh. not only do we sail, but uh -huh. really try to make the organization strong yeah. <laughs> by working on the website, which is B-A-A-D-S dot org. Oh, okay, good. And yeah. uh, then there's many events, social mm -hmm. events throughout yeah. the year. Okay. <laughs> um, we started out the fall with a Halloween party, oh. <laughs> a, a sort of a pirate party. Oh, cute! And it's very popular. Arr, matey, arr. Yes, <laughs> we are. Uh, we are. Your with, pirate on there. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a really fun That's fun cute. event. 
And that makes everybody relaxed. Right. Too, you know? <laughs> and we have several regattas throughout the year uh -huh, yeah. for the small boats. And yeah. we have racing like on Friday eight, Friday nights and wow. some other times during the season. Wow. Oh my gosh. So we basically sail 12 yeah. months out of the year. Wow, that's fantastic. And it's it's not very expensive. Uh, I mean, yeah, if you decide yeah. to become a member, right, right. Um, <laughs> it's $40 individually. Yeah. And so with reservations, yeah. right. <laughs> you just call a phone number, <laughs> yeah. which happens to be 415-281-0212. And... Um, <laughs> You make a reservation, right. you'll right. be asked a couple questions mm -hmm. such as, do you have a disability? Yeah. <laughs> um, what types of needs do you uh, prefer? Right, right. And then someone <laughs> will call you back okay. and let you know what boat you're on. Yeah. <laughs> and then it's, it's small boats on Saturday oh, okay. and then large keel boats on Sunday. Oh, so I must have gone on a Sunday. Yes. yes. <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, it's... because there were like three boats, I think, mm -hmm. that day that we went on. One or, well, right. At least two. We yeah. actually have four keel boats. Wow. That, so, wow. and we'll take out all four if we have enough people. The, if mm -hmm. the demand is it's there. a lot of yeah. Yeah. sailors. Wow. And we'd actually like to get more, but it's always the, the challenge is finding the dock space, oh, you know, wow. for the boat. <laughs> yeah. So. A couple of things oh is... Because there are so many new members uh, yeah. and there's so many people that are interested, yeah. uh, we have a lot of sales and different uh, things that we need for the boat oh, donated yeah. oh, wow. by yeah. marinas mm -hmm. and other yacht yeah. clubs within the Bay Area. Uh, yeah. And it's <laughs> extremely helpful because we are a nonprofit oh, right, right. and we have an extremely tight budget. Yeah. So yeah. we're always looking for, uh, you know, donations right, throughout right. the year, right. yeah. uh, at the end of the year. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's uh, very common for an organization to give us money and uh -huh. we're greatly appreciated because yeah. uh, yeah. it's something we really need. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, as our Commodore and, and Treasurer says, <laughs> We're, we're running a really tight tight ship. ship. Ah! Yes, we really <laughs> need anything that uh, people can That's do. Cool. But that allows us, mm -hmm. by yeah. having the membership do right, very right. low, yeah, yeah. Um, it allows us to bring more mm -hmm. opportunities and right. more people yeah. to sail exactly. and more fun. <laughs> yeah. And so we're always looking for volunteers, that able-bodied yeah. people <laughs> right, that right. can help us. Mm -hmm. And yeah. it's a lot of fun. Yeah. You know, South Beach Marina right. and with the Yacht Club. And also, you, um, I think, Daniel, you told me that you do a lot of the filming of the, the uh, different activities that, that you guys have been involved with. And well, yeah, the way that right. we uh, uh -huh. get our YouTube videos yeah, right, is, right. I mean, we've had some professional film yeah. crews come in, but we do a lot of the filming ourselves, yeah. and then Pam it does most of the editing right. once it's filmed. It's and fun. Get yeah. it up on YouTube, and uh, yeah. it turns out to be, as you found out, a very right. good uh, PR type of vehicle oh, for yeah. getting people to know, so what is it? Right, and, right. Uh, yeah. For people that aren't sure whether they want to get involved or not. So, exactly. Yeah. Well, um, actually, Pam, what is the... The um, address, the, the email that they can write to, or the... Well, you could start out by um, uh, B-A-A-D-S okay. dot org. Oh, okay. And Which then, is the website. Yes. Oh, okay. 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 And then you can also, okay. the easiest way to get to our videos okay. yeah. and to arm all my videos uh, on sailing right, right. <laughs> or instructional videos on how to assemble a boat, okay, you know, yeah. to how to put up all the sails right. and everything. <laughs> You just, um, my, I'm Pam Prentice, okay. so that's P-A-M-P-R-E-N-T-I-C-E okay. 2020. Okay. okay. And just Google that. Okay. Put that cool. into any search on the computer, and you'll see my YouTube videos. <laughs> right, but it's, it's 2020, not D-W-E-N-T. Right, exactly. Right. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, 20, excellent. <laughs> um, but, you know, and I actually looked that up, and there were some phenomenal Phenomenal oh, thank uh, you. videos, both of you guys have thank done. Thank you. So. We enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> Great. I even like the puppy. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Little King Charles Spaniel. Yeah, I That's love... Fred <laughs> that. Oh, that, yeah. Yeah, we have, we, <laughs> actually in BADS, we have a lot of uh, yeah. 
oh. service dogs. Oh, yeah. Uh, they right. come, right. usually there's one on every boat, uh -huh. somebody right. sight impaired yeah, that's or true. even uh, some type of disability oh, right. that they feel more comfortable with an animal. Right. So we have a lot yeah. of dogs. and So I ended up doing <laughs> videos about dogs oh, that are actually great. very popular too. Yeah. yeah. But people, well, and, yeah. and also, but what's really uh, amazing, though, is that you guys are so involved in all kinds of different activities. <laughs> and one of them was the um, the Little People LPA. Oh. Uh, and it's lpaonline.org, right? Correct. That's yeah. the and, uh, national people if they're, website, yeah. You know, for little people. Right. And people who want to learn more about the organization can... Look right, that up and, and th see. that kind of overlaps <laughs> with uh, because we are right. um, of short stature, <laughs> right, right, yeah. and it we are very very active in Little People mm. of America. Right, well, right. we started when we were very young, and yeah. now we're we're older, and we really <laughs> respect the organization, right. and it's international. Yeah. So, but you have a local chapter. Oh yes, we have a very active chapter yeah, in, in great. San Francisco yeah. area. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and I was mentioning that um, we met my friend Deb there. She, oh, uh, Deb Yarbrough. Right, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. And then uh, also um, uh, Matt Roloff. Right. Yes. Yeah, right, because we lived up in Oregon, and he uh, he has a pumpkin yes. farm that yes. you can go and, and well, right. he has a little, he has a show also. Right, What's yeah. It called? Little People. A Little People Big, big world. world. Right, right, right. Right, yeah. Yeah, so, but it was a lot of fun going up to his, uh, his farm and picking out a couple pumpkins each year. <laughs> he's <laughs> done, fun. he's yeah. been so valuable for yeah. the short stature community oh, yeah, yeah. because he's brought awareness mm -hmm. that everybody can do anything. Yeah. It just takes a, a certain way of doing things. Right, yeah. But Matt actually lived uh, uh, down in the South Bay oh, in, yeah. in California yeah. for a long time. Yeah, and he's originally yeah. from the San Bruno area. Right. Well, we yeah. I, we were in Shriners Hospital together a long well, time ago. Well, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So. And look at you now. That's right. Yes. <laughs> so, but anyway. So, maybe one more time, tell us what the um, the website is. Yeah. Okay, it's B-A-A-D-S okay. okay. dot, dot org. Okay. And if you have any questions, just put it in the comments okay. section or whatever. But if people go to that website and right. check it out, right different things but from there they can okay. find out how to make reservations okay. they can find out about all of our various programs yeah, that we have going on good. who to contact and everything well daniel i want to thank you so very oh, much sure. for joining yes. us thank you and pam thank you that was so much fun <laughs> this was great okay <laughs> and thank you so very much for joining us until next time i'm donna yeager with on the move have a wonderful day Collect our dreams, take them on the move. If we collect our dreams, take them on the move. So let's pick up our dreams, take them on the move.